Well, folks, that may not look like much, but that's a major victory for me. That is uh, AC voltage coming off of the stubble field secondary. And uh, I got the stubble field so it'll run uh, beyond a day. I built it more carefully and used just uh, uh, more care when I built it. And uh, it's still running. And uh, I ran it on a jewel thief circuit last night. Then I put more windings on the primary and then put a little secondary on it too. And just have it running that little spinner. But as that uh, makes and breaks the contact on that lead switch, that's causing that secondary coil there to get an induced voltage off of the primary and make that voltage happen on the back end. Now what I'm doing here, I'm coming off that very small secondary and I'm putting it through a transformer. This is a transformer that's taking that um, basic AC that's coming off of it and boosting it up enough to show on the meter. Now that's not much, that's less than half a volt, but I've got very few windings on my secondary. That thing is supposed to be filled all the way up. You've seen Laser Sabers videos. So anyway, I just wanted to uh, share with people that this can be done if it's done carefully. And uh, I just don't know how to go from here. I put a little capacitor on the coil to help the little pulse motor part of it. But I'm pretty sure we could just trigger this electronically and get that thing to happen. So anyway, this is a, a continuing project. I haven't abandoned it yet, but uh, it's still got some major question marks as far as how long that coil will continue to produce enough electricity to allow this to go on. So anyway, that's where I'm at today with the stubble field coil and a secondary winding.